Thank you, everyone. Good afternoon. It is Monday, November 16th. Thank you so much for accommodating our reschedule. Uh, we had to juggle some things around, so thanks so much for that. Um, obviously, things are happening very, very quickly. You've probably just seen the news release that we just sent out. I see it circulating on social media very, very quickly. So Premier will just start us off very quickly with um, a little bit of an opening. Dr. P will, sorry, Dr. Patterson will talk um, a little bit about what this all means specifically. Then we'll get into questions and answers. Please one question, one follow up, and then we'll circulate again. And then Minister Kusugak is going to end us with some final thoughts. So thank you very much. Oya nami kai gum nagati unu sakut ulumina gajau November 16 dan akhir ya kawat digoi kakanga biat sahak tu magalu gata dan alu tau sakir tau gata tu pival le ayu lagi nato sakat sak nalu naik simat dahku sakir pival ni nginik dan nasi bulat tu kalau malau lu nilu tau paru seno kalau malang ayok taman nak isu nitu kekang mangak amalu apa sokat tu sita kau mak mak kuarti minister kusuga piar ayu tu kalang amiyo kau sita kau lu nih. Juna bumi obluku capa pi, tanah hanan naung itu lewak. Matamani nunu builoni, tuhau malu tuhau maluk tak kau lega pi tanah nunu builoni. Eighteen guyu tanu ban naya kalau mata, amata aku inuit malik tau yut la kau yak tau yut nuban nuban naya nineteen kaya mengata mana mudik itu lewak four thousand and seventeen guyu. Ang matakwa 735 huli malik tao yung kawihak tao yung anyang yung mga ata. Watch out na Dr. Patterson unik ka rin na matakwa nun na builuan yung kwarta pala nilang magapta takwa huna yung kwarta niya mga kanwin niya mga unik ka naman. Kihani ta na okala kakit na guwaka kawak yung matakwa kawima yung ata nun na builuan yung ako na niya matakwa yung kwarta pala nilang Lalu tak, lalu kuat pelajaran yang mungkin open ngatu, kerana tan nabi ayah kan lari tu tan na ane ane nubuan nak jual ni nak kai gak kerap tigo, ayat tu lori nang nak kai gak kaman tan angin di luar kerap tigo guna nubu iluani, tan ihumagi 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 di guna tan nak kuat tin, lalu kuat tin New York tan na King Upper ni atau guna nak kau ni atau guna tan na nubuan nak jual kipi gak lugu nak kuat tiga lugu angin di luar kerap tigo. Amat aku tuhan ulang nada ulang dulu nuna bumi ut, aku kian okak kena nana tunga, ubla luk tangi luta, amat aku amihu luta keting angin tang keting tangi luta, unga higi luta agu boem 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 micah taluit, amat ana tau ane aluit, aihi malu ti pilih gayak tangi luti ubla luk tangi luti aihi malu ti, mana yo tak aku madi madi gayak. Tabut mana luar ya, tanya kawin mana lama, tanya nubuat 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 nub Kita luk tak ane lagi yang nak pada tak kau pilih lagi yang hubuk yang hubuk lagi yang guna yang mata kau akor orang ni kau pilih lagi orang ni kau ni so dan nala cialah lewat unga hit tinggi luta ubla luk tinggi luta agak boleh yang mewah yang macam tak luar ama ane rovi atau ane tu yang rovi ahi malu tu. Tama pada luk tak tak kau nala cialah opti kau tanya kipi ni apa opti kau tanya ane nuan nak jual angin luar kau tu nego. Ama kau yang mahu mengata aku malik cakap tu kita nak hal hal lagi nak tahu nombor nombor yang nineteen, nombor mewut nak hal cakap lagi, apa ni aku mat nak apa ke kau yang mahu menalang ni apa mat nak. Good afternoon. It's been a hard weekend, and as you know, we have eighteen confirmed cases of COVID nineteen in Nunavut. The total number of persons followed to date is 4,017, and there are 735 persons currently being followed. Dr. Patterson will explain the new territorial-wide measures we are putting into place in just a moment. But before I, before I let him do that, I would like to say that I know this will be hard. We do not want to be back to the restrictions we had in the spring, but for the health and safety of all Nuvunmuk, this is necessary. Think of it as circuit breaker, a chance to reset. No one is above the rules here. Let's make this clear. So there's no misunderstanding. Do not visit. 
do not socialize outside your household. And I cannot stress this enough, stay home, even if you feel the smallest bit of sickness in you. It is more important than ever that we do everything we can to help our communities, and we can do this. There are essential and critical workers on the front lines working around the clock to keep Nunavut Mute safe and healthy. Please don't let all their work and sacrifice go to waste. If we all do our part, we will be in a much better position in early December. Please don't take chances. Unless it's absolutely necessary, stay home and stay safe. Thank you. Good afternoon. Um, wrong sheet, sorry. Apologies for that. Overnight, we confirmed six new cases of COVID-19 in Aviat and two in Rankin Inlet. So although, as the Premier said, the total was 18 yesterday, as of today, it is 26 cases of COVID-19 in Nunavut. Our public health and rapid response teams are working around the clock to trace and test in efforts to track and contain the virus. Through our uh, investigations, we have concern that COVID-19 may spread to additional communities which is why we are initiating a territory-wide lockdown with restrictions similar to what we saw in March and April. April <laughs> We are taking these steps for at least the next two weeks to prevent further spread of COVID-19. Effective Wednesday and territory-wide, all gatherings are restricted to five people and there shall be no gatherings in homes. All for-profit and not-for-profit businesses must, must close with the exception of grocery stores, fuel and motor vehicle service stations, Canada Post and financial institutions. Restaurants may open for takeout services only. All schools, including Nunavut Arctic College, federal, territorial, and municipal government offices must close to all but essential work. Schools will be providing remote learning options. Personal services like hairstylists, masseuse, and the like must close. All sporting organizations are suspended. Fitness centers, gymnasiums, and pools are closed. Libraries, museums, and galleries are closed. Takwa kanu ilige ako tigit na atabut makunik pinaso ako si Indik. Taman na siya mapalit gurni jo na kulugo no ba juan na nineteen. Pingat siya may pigyar luni no na buli mami katin niyo katag tuli mat isulit tabehan na ato tali maugun na lutik ambalo katin katag tuhaga ako na ato ang ikarigaw yun ni.
To protect our elders, all the visitation to elder centers and long-term care centers is on hold for at least two weeks unless approved by the uh, public health physician on call. We also ask that elders closely monitor themselves for any signs of the virus and call their health center immediately if they feel unwell. If community members are checking on elders, please maintain strict distancing and avoid going inside homes if possible. Health centers are closed except for emergencies. The Kikiktani General Hospital is no longer accepting walk-ins. Please call ahead and you will be assessed over the phone. Anyone who visits a health center or hospital must wear a mask. If you have questions relating to COVID-19 or want to know if you should be tested, please call the COVID-19 hotline at 1-888-975-8601. Calling the hotline will allow our health staff to focus on managing the outbreak. Calls to the health center should be for emergencies only. Thank you. Nuna Katigid, how you get hot down there, Rotik, in Nahoti Minota, Kua, Hanit Salwa Tele Hatar Lutik, Amalo, Isahatang in Lutik, Angakang in Nun. Nuna Linan Nair beat Matuja or Yut Kisanito Avon Nartuleri Kunar Lutik, Rikitani Anna Bealokta, Nice to it Nabu Hatare Hau Nertu, Sibon Ragohal Kahatar Lusi, Hala Tiku, Hari Sakta Hatar Narazi, Anna Bealum Wesit Tele gets yet a perios among it to uh, Kent Driscoll, APTN National News. Uh, Dr. Patterson, in your opening remarks, you said there was possible evidence of spread to other communities. I'm wondering what more can you tell us about that evidence? Um, Wait. Oh, sorry. Can this go AP Tian Kunik Luta Patterson or how sing or how sluty or how cargo with a man the same of a letter in a hunting and not a singing no nona lid not Hanotamana Mitchilling? Right now it's actually more concern. It's uh, we know that there were people in Aviat who uh, left before the case was, uh, the initial case was identified, uh, some of whom have been named as contacts and we've been in touch with, others may have been exposed, and so that raises that concern. Uh, kids in two of Nunavut's three regions went to school this morning. I can't imagine there will be very many going tomorrow. Why wasn't this announcement about Wednesday's lockdown made prior to schools opening this morning? Uh, 
Summelita, how you cut so to give me la pinga summita, and a matu yo la lingani. Because the for the other regions where the risk is lower, the harm by doing it uh, too fast and causing problems uh, will create more harm than good. So doing it uh, in a way that gives the schools and others a day or two to prepare and uh, get everything ready makes more sense and is going to have less, is not going to have much impact on the illness. So. Um, is there evidence of community transmission in Arviat at the moment, and what are you doing to contain that, if so? I'm trying to Canadian press go nita koali no nari ne se ama pali ani ngani nalo na tau samale khar de ani ambalo hanu ili ro te khaki no khar te tau hulu. Yeah, there has been community transmission occurring in Arviat uh, in the last little while. Um, it will take one to two weeks to know if the measures that we put in place for Aviat last week are um, effective. Um, and we're encouraging everybody to follow not only the rules but all of the all of the recommendations. Only one person from each household going to the store to shop, um, being very careful about wearing a mask when they're out, washing their hands, um, and uh, keeping their social bubble to their household only for now. Excuse me. I am not sure if I am a person who is 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 a so masks are mandatory in the Kibbalik. Um Why have you not extended that mandatory mask? Uh, Policy to the rest of the territory. We're strongly recommending it. Like um, it's, we we debated about that, but where lots of people don't have masks, where um, they'll need some time to. Uh, get them where some people are very uncomfortable wearing masks and can't because of anxiety and claustrophobia. Um, we wanted to at least give some option for uh, the other areas, but obviously it would be preferable if everybody who could wore a mask. <laughs> Jackie McKay, CBC News. There's lots of rumors going around that some of these new confirmed cases are in a Kaluit. Can you say if any confirmed cases are in a Kaluit? Jackie McKay, CBC, Kunik, Tusak Narsima, Matako, and Alonato, Sima Yohalera, and Ehalun Nitan, and Tukisinar City Garum Nakio. Thanks, and no, that that is incorrect. Um, I had to censor myself on that one. It's not true, uh, and we are still committed that we will be public when there's COVID in a new community, we will go public within 24 hours. and. If we haven't said that there is, then people should ignore those rumors. Thank you. 
Suli tak kono le ne khawi ya to khato akka kikko to na ne khaw khaw ji ke chauti ga yak to 24 ka kai tu ngani suli ngit to ne gava makko ne ngit to ne khaw se jo ne suli yo sa khat ga kha ngit to inoi would you call this um an outbreak in nunavut and would you are you willing to say now if it's linked to isolation hubs in winnipeg Ano ho sa regular na si Biu taman na siya mapalayan nila kayo lang nga nino na bumi ang maloha ko na kita ko winipig mi ta ko siya magbiu palayan lang nga nino. Yeah, this is an outbreak, um, and it it certainly is um, very suspicious that it's linked to the hubs or to something that happened while exiting the hubs where uh, the timing is in that uh, in that area. But where exactly it happened, from anywhere from the hubs to the airport, uh, we don't know yet. Eh, taman na siya mapalayan nila kayo lakto. Tay ma, eh, pasagusun na kayo lahat sa mga lakto ka na pigi akto minyo ni nga ni kalo na ni toyo mibiminga akto nun. Kanga kursi man ni nga, tay ma, toki sinakto tako na nga kalo na ni toyo mibiminga akto ni. Tama sa mga palayak tumi ni wiyang akis ay nilalo na yon ng itabu na milata so luto yung mivingin ni ubalo hanga tayo kung mo palayak tilugit sa mga biu ng mga tasa luto nilalo na yata ng ito. Just one second, Dustin. With that said, our current work is focused on stopping transmission um, to protect as many uh, people from getting the infection as possible. Um, in good time, when things settle down, we'll get back to. The information we have from the origins of this, and get into that, and see how that can uh, that information can be used to modify our policies and protocols at, in isolation. Taman na lo kau yun na rupta na kung ano mga sayang mapalaya niyo pigyan ni mininga tayo at tuwa yak tayo at asid yak tayo gutiyo lutik kano tayo at tuwa gaw yung malip tayo gaya lilo asid yak tayo gaya kung taman na tayo may likkan na kung nago. Dustin Patarna, Natsiak News. We've been dealing with confirmed cases. There's 26 now, I believe. What can you say about presumptive cases? Dustin Patarno na siya kung nilitak ko alin o kaos kaos sa mga tatuan ni Sixth Gunner at tao lang lutik tak ko nalo na yata si Mayut at siya walik kaya o kaos sa kung nakikita ko pasagiya o tuin nakto. There are no presumptive cases. Presumptive is in in right now. Presumptive is the term we used when we had positive results from a lab device or instrument that hadn't gone through the process to provide confirmatory results. Uh, both of the biofires we have, the one in Rankin and the one in Akalawit, uh, they're able to provide confirmatory results. Uh, of the 26 cases, are you able to talk a little bit about how many are symptomatic or asymptomatic? I, I don't know that information, to be honest. Uh, everybody is still, uh, there's the one individual who was medevac to Winnipeg, the rest remain at home. Uh, Trevor Wright, none of our news. Um, <clears throat> is there a risk of community transmission in Rankin Inlet now that the um, second Rankin case has been linked to Arviat? Trevor Wright, none of our community has been linked to Arviat. None of our community has been linked to Arviat. None of our community has been linked to Arviat. None of our community has been linked to Arviat. None of our community has been linked to Arviat. None of our community has been linked to Arviat. Not at this point, no. Agaw yomana. 
Okay. Um, could you also reiterate the um, fines people were faced for not following um, the restrictions in place that have been put in place now? Or? Sorry, I can't remember the exact numbers, Premier. 575 for individual and 29 something for a company. So 575 for an individual and 2,900 something for a company or corporation. Sorry. Five hundred. Seventy-five dollars, five hundred seventy-five dollars. Nakili tita gunakto balo two thousand nine hundred. Kachikya ta ko ano? Nami ni kaktyo yun labyo yun lo ni si kumit si ni katamali tao galin. Una di nang minang mo apat na lao tao galaw kihay kio yao himalak matita kaku. Um, kano? Ami hung o loak tayo linang minokak ti tao himanak pa kawye hak tao lo ti inung nu balo ba kano pilirakak pi hinukang iti nang mi. I had other questions but this one is a bit more open now. So the people that have COVID-19 in those two, three communities, what kind of efforts are you making to monitor them or prevent them from spreading to other people in the community? Uh, yeah. <laughs> Sorry, Jordan. Most of them, uh, most of them will be getting calls every, uh, at set periods, every day or two. Um, some may be getting uh, checked physically more often uh, than others. It, it depends on the circumstances. And uh, we're getting them to uh, strictly stay at home. Ilu nata jelak tak ku, oh kalau view kat tak tu, angin kau si maju it, ulu tamat, ubalu makul, luna gay mati oh kalau view kat tak tu, ilang eh kau isak tau lata kat tak eli tak ku jauh lutik, pijut tingin me, pijut tak kau sute, aje gay kat tangin mata, kisah ni tak ku, aje gay gua berhangit tu, angin kau si maju natu ina ku jauh lu. Kent Driscoll, EPTN National News. Dr. Patterson, when you answered the question about the medical hubs and the travel hubs, now you said you want to focus on stopping community spread before spending too much energy on what may or may not have happened at those hubs. And doesn't that mean, though, however the virus got in, that door could still be open? Isn't finding out what could have happened at the medical hubs a big part of stopping community spread? Kentusko APT and Kurnik Luta Padus and Kirkog of Itako, Halonani, to your movie, Pitcher to Gilugit, to Raga Hatu Nangam, the Rasu, to Nokatita Hulugu, Nuna Linisar Mapalianinga, Kisani Litako, Suli, Tiki Palagun Namning, Suli, Matuing at Sanga Tema, Sumalitako, Matuya Jangil Latako, Halonaninga, to do your movie Minga Hatatu, to Raga Yanga to Nara Hangin Matasa, Matitsi Valle, Kanehunagi. Yeah, it is, and we've uh, we've taken a number of steps in terms of reviewing policies and protocols with uh, contractors, and, and um, in at least one or two cases, I think they've requested uh, consideration for extra staff, and we have authorized that to uh, do things to minimize the risk of exposure. I'll let Uli translate, interpret that, sorry. Eh, taman na suli yung kasi nagdiging ito na hanule o tahak palaga at tamak ko ahim ko palaga ng nagsuti ko ato agawot malita ko yawulo tako at ako ang tractor sa mayon nita may aperi jo ka sa mam at ako sa mam ako kanini ekana yata ako malutik ekayon na ato ni taman na sa mam palaga ng nagsuti ko palaga yung may kulugo to yung may binminga at tato ni in terms of identifying the exact cause for what happened and getting down to that level of detail, um, the work required to do that might be counterproductive at this point. So we do want to find out. We do want to, uh, we do want to find out exactly what happened and, and see if we can make things work better with that. But um, uh, our biggest effort is going into stopping transmission right now. Mm -hmm. Nalu na yata ugun ng nga nakingalarit si mga mga suli. Nalu na yata ugun ng imat. Kanito kalarin ng mga 
tai ma ilu lingin ne ikta ma mana yo haus kalau agam nangin nata tai ma pijut kalau agam yang ni mata yang mega suara uta kau ibu kau ibu mat saya kalau waktu gud amaluki suli mahal ane kat saya kau jaga kalau agam tu saya ni mana yo tu gara tu gara kau nak bayu kat tu saya ma pale ni ane nak pijut si kau suara nangmu uh, contact tracing. Uh, that can be a very difficult process. Some people don't cooperate. Some people don't pick up the phone. Some people have reasons to not want to admit who they've been in contact with. Can you characterize how well or how poorly contact tracing efforts in Argyd in particular are going right now? Ilang ilu, kau tayli gum, kau tayli semua ilu, tiki kau tayli gum alu tillo. Tak kau alu, nalu naya si gum agati kikun nikat katis jemini orang anmik. Tak kau nalu naya orang nak kiki pilu waktu meyak dia ni katij katij awu jemini orang nak kau isak pelaya, nak kau ipelaya mana? You're correct that there's always going to be some people who don't want to participate in contact tracing or don't want to provide all of their answers. For some people, they just can't remember them. Um, this is why it's often uh, interviews carried out by two or more people at different times when to help people jog and or to help refresh their memory. Um, so it's uh, we'll just it, it's going well. The majority of people are participating uh, either physically or over the phone. So. Uh, time will tell if it's uh, if we can um, get enough contact tracing done to track down every route of transmission. Suli yuti tay mga lima ilangi inuhatigi tay mga ilaw ko makata gitut sa matakaw yung sakto na makati yahap tumi ni mga ilangi kyo ko mangit sa mga hatag sutik. Ila atau pilu ang waktu ilang yakha makatangi mata taka tay may mat atau sa mukko nulung ni mukko at tapos sa tao gal lahat taka yakha iti tao sa pala ako lugit taman na katiyas katiyam niyo yun ni aula na kat sa tao kaya sa pala nga taka walo amisun ng sayit ikayo kasuot sa tao kiyut sa lahat taka sutik tapos sa tao lute lunit taka ilu na taka yung pala ako magalawa katigo ko kani those are challenges that uh, every uh, area or jurisdiction that's experienced an outbreak has run into with uh, contact tracing. Um, but the evidence is pretty strong that the best ways to break transmission are with the public health measures that we have in place, the uh, simpler things that individuals can do themselves, like washing their hands and maintaining distancing and separation, and rigorous contact tracing to uh, identify and break all routes of transmission. <laughs> I'm a to the Canadian press. Uh, in the press release yesterday, it said people who have left Arvia since November 2nd should immediately isolate for 14 days. Can you explain more why um, why people should do that and why people traveling from other Kibbalik communities? I'm a transfer Canadian press community. Avianing after me, November two, me big ass, Hilamit Sauti, Yani Taylor, who you look at, no house or Yarum Nakio, some Marvianing after to a day, my mother, a singing the Kiba Lamita, my Titaugati. November second was the earliest date at which uh, transmission was occurring in Aviat, to the best of our knowledge. Um, we know that there's been transmission happening in the community that we haven't identified all the links at this point. And so it's possible that other people who were in Aviat were exposed but are now in other communities become symptomatic. And so 
uh, a concern would be if this is uh, spread unknowingly to other communities and we get similar events happening. So that's the rationale for the advice that went out on the weekend about uh, isolating people and to also help with limiting that spread. We've got the new measures coming into effect in the next 48 hours. Dana November 2, Dana Hula Muna Pangon Rata Maulu Taman Nasa Mapalia Layak to Minuning and Kaye Mayavu Malitivit, Kaye Maluta Lutana, Sar Mapalia Layak to Minuning and Nunangani, Takwa Lunaking and Mangata Sulhaye Mangin Latigo, Avani Pilo and Wartomi, Takwa Katia have to Minu Mata, a singing Ninunalit Nemu Tarni, Kaye Manatik, Hanui Gutihala Rati, Taman Nasa Mapalia and Harunangan. Somalo Tigi got Tigo Kisani, Kaui Mangina Tassing in Nunalin Nitu, Tame Hotigas Mayabu Indutu Ila, and it tailed Chauti Hulu get Amalita Gal in Naluna Sina Mayugu Kapani Bodi, Nas Malakata. We're seeing more and more cases come up in Navia. There was ten yesterday and six today. Um, can you speak about? Does that tell us anything about when that transmission occurred? Would it mean that it occurred around the same time? La commission of Palia to Nati Lugisama, Bivalia, Arvani, Epat Sahuli, Nalunato, Lotil Lugit, Amalo Six, Luminalunato, Tilugit, Tan Takwato, Kusama Palia, Yuminuni, Nalala, how you Narseba? Not necessarily, it may point towards one single event like that, but um, the average. Uh, most people, about three quarters, the incubation period is somewhere between five and eight days after exposure. So there's enough variability that you can't definitively link it that way. Sama Bula did look at him, Madame Natoxu, Louis Tama, Hanui could have Palia had turning it, Malit to get Taco and Alona Simayavo. You would need more information based on contact tracing and seeing where people were exposed. Uh, if we find things in that part of it that helps modify orders in the future, we'll happily do so, but uh, for with the information just on the date of uh, diagnosis, no, it doesn't tell you enough. Jackie McKay, CBC News. For people who are homeless or couch surfing or going between different houses and shelters, what are these people supposed to be doing um, at this moment? Jackie McKay, CBC News. If we're finding people uh, who are identified as contacts um, who are in that scenario, we're uh, looking for alternative ways to isolate them. Um, and we've done that a number of times in the past. How you to have the Tamako and Alunato Samayo Hamanga, Katija, you have to be new Manga, Nova Joanna to Leo Jim with Taima, Anka Hangi to Nick Taima. How you got so out to go Nartavunami, any daily good Namanga, that I may have Tassimali to Talulumim. I've heard of situations where um, RCMP were called to houses that have people who are in isolation. What are the precautions taken for RCMP officers who might have to enter? Um, houses that have people who have been in contact. Uh, 
for RCMP and uh, ambulance, any other any other um, frontline response first responders who are going into a house in a situation like that, especially in Aviat, Rankin, and Sandy Kilowack, we'd recommend uh, wearing masks when they go in. And I think for the RCMP and several others, it's actually mandatory, like it's part of their um, organizational policy to wear the masks. It has been over a week since the first case in Saniki Law and Wednesday, on Wednesday the Nunavut wide restrictions will start. Will the, will the community continue to uh, follow the restrictions even after the, the first case has been two weeks? Yeah. Yes. Um, so when you've had a case of COVID in, in a community, the individual is uh, infectious for up to 10 days. Um, and then their contacts, especially household contacts, need to be in isolation for 14 days after the last day that they're infectious. Um, so there's that. And then to truly say that an outbreak is over, the worldwide standard for COVID-19 will be 28 days after the last person is infectious. So um, there's a little bit of time to go, but obviously the longer we go without cases of COVID-19 in Santa Kilowack, the better things are looking. there may be duty travels that went, arrived to Saniki Law and were to come back, but the case was found there. What will happen after two weeks for the duty traveler? Um, any, uh, and there's been a few people who've traveled out, they can, if they're having trouble, uh, well, they can contact the CPHO travel requests at gov.nu.ca, same for people who want, who are in the Kivalik and want to travel, they can contact that uh, email address and we'll work out the ways to get them a letter to approve travel if it's appropriate. I'll uh, let Uli translate. Interpret. Interpret, sorry. CPHO travel request at gov.nu.ca. The the purpose of that, is, the biggest purpose is to ensure that 
uh, people who are known to be contacts don't fly and, and that we limit the chance of spreading COVID-19 from one of the communities that already has it to other communities that don't have it. So um, it's really important that people um, uh, cooperate with us on that. Uh, this question is from Bailey Morton of Moose FM in the All Life. She just wants to know if there will be any changes to the common travel areas. Bailey, can I get a little knife made on a period of time? I will be able to get a little knife made on a period of for Nunavut returning to Nunavut from the Northwest Territories, there will be no change. Nunavut to NWT? Uh, Nunavut coming back, or people coming back from, from NWT. NWT to here. But remember that travelers from Nunavut going to the Northwest Territories is the Northwest Territory government's decision, so they may or may not uh, want to revisit that. Justin Pizarro, News. Does this, does the, the restrictions starting on Wednesday, does that change anything with guests returning from isolation hubs or guests that are going to be going into isolation? Dustin Patari on a check of Nick Tamakua, Kisulima, Matuja over Lena, Tilogi, Pingat, Sumitamanas, Jerutown, Katamakun, or to your moving more hat up to Nick Town and Halona and Utah Paleo. No, um, guests in the isolation hubs who um, don't want to, who want to wait a bit uh, to see what's happening can stay a little bit longer, but otherwise, them returning home is fine. I'm not sure who the next question is for, but I'll ask it and figure it out. Uh, two weeks is a long time uh, for businesses to remain closed. There's going to be a lot of people impacted by this, of course, in Rankin and Santa Kilowatt. And Okay, yeah, there's already been closed. What kind of resources are available to Nunavut who are losing work because of this? What kind of what? Resources. Taku amaku pingan sa Rusi ako niya lum mata tama ko na mene hati o yuma tuya usi magaya hati lugi pilo ako mika ng sinong mesa ni kilo ang mga vel nilo kisunay ka yung kotit sa hakat tama ko nung. Thanks for the question. We are working on that, just like uh, earlier on this spring when we had uh, packages for businesses and other organizations. We are working on one, and I expect an announcement in the very near future. Uh, Kent Friscoli, PTN National News. That's uh, for Dr. Patterson. Uh, this is a fairly straightforward one. I've been receiving some questions from listeners and viewers wondering specifically about the indoor and outdoor gathering limits. Uh, could you just go through how many people are allowed to gather outdoors, how many people are allowed to gather indoors? Outdoors is five. Uh, indoors at households, it's households plus five, or like a permanent residence plus five. But we, that five is there to, you know, somebody needs tradespeople to come in to fix, uh, to do some emergency work or those sorts of things. We really would strongly recommend that people not treat it as a loophole to have five people over to have a small party. Um, so 
uh, ideally zero. Silami talima hataro nato amalo ilo ilo ani ta ko ilo me hatigi ha kaniga zo talima ko nafsute ta na talima ni rato yu ma pejo te hatu ni nafsune suru sana giato ga rene sana giato ga to to ha kato ga nafte kud isu hataro na hulugit kisa ni sangi yu me atu le kuya vuta man na ima atu ni luta ho na go suru talima i parte ko ma pata te ma te ma ho jingu cha galo ga ta te ma ima pula ga pula ga te hata ho jigu ni galo ga tego. ขอยินดีครับเรามาอยู่ลูกตาของเราครับแต่ตอนนั้นนึกว่าจะเอาหนักไนทีนึกว่านึกว่ามุดที่คิดตัวมันเรื่องอะไรมันแต่มันนี่
we have a chance to prevent further spread of this virus by working together and staying apart. We can do this, and we will do this. Christmas is fast approaching, and by putting the hard work in now to stop the spread of the of this virus, we hopefully will be able to have a, a good Christmas at home with our family. But that's up to us. Please, let's listen to the rules put forward to us by uh, Dr. Patterson. Please remain calm and vigilant, and, and we can we can get by this. Wait a minute.